Under the cover of the night, our journey unfolds like a tapestry of dreams, weaving through the silent realms, where stars are the storytellers, and the moon our faithful guide through the mysteries of the nocturnal voyage. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use AI to create these amazing images in just a few minutes. It is completely easy to use and pretty fun to do. I mean, look at these tools. You can generate AI images with different styles and various ways. Similar to Midjourney, it can generate images from text prompt, offering free capabilities. The prompt is very simple, just daily words and phrases and the image quality is absolutely amazing. Introducing Dreamina. This is AI art tool and soon to be AI video tool which is connected to CapCut and got some really cool features that I like to show you today. Click the link in the description below and open Dreamina on your web browser. You can try it for free because they will give you at least 60 tokens per day. The more active you are, the more tokens you can earn. Here you can start generate images with text prompt. Enter your text description to explain what you want to happen in the image. If you click reference, it's basically use your image as the reference generation, but I will show you later. Let's go ahead by select the model. I choose XL Pro. I'm gonna set the quality to about 9 for better image quality. And I set the aspect ratio to landscape or 16 by 9. And click on generate. We have four options and choose between the ones that you like. Or click on generate again to generate more images. I select this one and you can upscale this image to get better quality. If you are working on portrait photo, after upscaling your image, you can retouch to enhance the detail which a lot better. If you go at home, you can also explore for AI prompts that people have used it. So there are some many options that you can choose from. Just try to find one according to your liking. So I'm going to select this one and select use prompt. So I'm going to reference and choose this portrait. Then I select human face so that Dreamina will automatically detect the details of your face and generate AI images. I keep everything normal here and click generate. We just turn photo from this to this. So, you can guide image generation with references to retain the structure of the search image. Another cool feature that you can try is canvas option. This is where you can do things like in painting, expand image, remove any objects, etc. You can start by upload your image here or start generating AI images as we did before. So I'm going to choose this one. I'm gonna change the canvas size. All right, let's try with expand and drag this out to expand the image. Then you can write text prompt here, but I'm gonna leave that and click expand. It will use AI to fill in this blank area now choose which one the best. Now let's try with in paint. Another cool feature that allow you to edit or add any objects you want using text prompt. 
use the brush tool to mark the object you like to edit. Now, describe what you want to generate in the image. And there you go. I think this one looks good. And I'm gonna impine lake over here. That is absolutely amazing. You can also remove any objects with this AI tool. And we can retouch, upscale image, and remove background automatically with just simple clicks, which make our creative process a lot easier. So that's how to generate and edit your image with Dreamina. It was a lot easier and much more accessible to people that don't know much about design. Especially when you do video editing in CapCut, this is a great tool for you to create video thumbnail or image material. So, I'm really excited what you do in Termina. Share your artwork in the comment below and let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching, we will see you in the next one.